Hey guys, it's Big Kev, the tall legend here. You want a treat? You want a snack? Thanks for doing my intro. <laughs> Today, yes, I know the dog's cute, okay? You can follow him at kevin.d.shiba on Instagram. Link is also in the description. We get it. Today, thank you though for everyone who has um, followed him there. It's been an overwhelming response. Today, we will be opening up these Nintendo Game Packs from Tops. Uh, these are released back in 1989. There's a few different pack artworks. We've got Link here, and then we've got a Mario one. Uh, these are the only two I think that I have. I think there is a few more. And they have top secret tips uh, for Nintendo games, I'm, I'm imagining. And this is back before, uh, you know, accessible internet. If you want to know any tips or cheats or anything for a video game, you had to hear it on the schoolyard. Or buy Nintendo Power. Or your dad had to work at Nintendo. Which was quite common, I hear. Now, Tops was originally founded... Um, in Brooklyn, New York in 1938 and oh my god How fucking cool is that? Uh, and this is kind of like a, a children's scratch card. I think Okay, we've got a bunch of different Scratch cards. I don't know if the um, the coloring is supposed to look like this or if it, they've just faded. Oh Those are so cool. What's Mario doing to this shy guy? Looks like he's gonna put his dick in that tube. See what that mask do. Why does Shy Guy look so fucked and like lumpy? So Tops is uh, mostly known for doing uh, sports cards, baseball, football, hockey, etc. But they've done pretty much everything else in between and I think they're still running. Uh, we've got Williams here with some golden shins. I think he's from uh, Double Dragon. Doesn't have much else on the card. We've got the tip on the back. Top secret. Don't tell anyone, kids. Super Mario Bros. 2. Scampering up and down vines is the amazing hoopster. If you manage to ride onto his head, you'll win a free ride. Make sure you keep that in mind next time you're playing Super Mario Bros. 2. And don't tell anyone else. Or I will literally fucking kill you. Uh, last of all, we've got Punch-Out! Where's Lil Mac at? That's all I know. And these, I think, are stickers. Don't know how well they stick after this many years. There we go. That's, uh, something to look at. We'll have a look at these scratch cards in just a second. I just want to show you guys some more weird, old, retarded shit that I got a long time ago. I've got a lot of these. I think I bought two large boxes of either really old, rejected, out of date, or just unsellable playing cards. I didn't know what I was getting. It was just this huge mixed batch. We've got Backstreet Boys <laughs> Series 1 Chase Program. You can get the metalized foil album set. Foil stamp, rainbow foil, signature set, and uh, probably a bunch of other weird shit. Oh, you can also, apparently, you can get um, rookie signature cards. Now, the thing is with signature cards, I think sometimes um, their signatures are just printed on there, but there are other cards which a signature card is literally an inserted signed card. Literally signed with a texter. I'm assuming they do a, a bunch of them by whatever celebrity and then they get sent to the company and they insert those cards as super rare signature cards. Uh, we've got Saved by the Bell, the college years. And <laughs> this is a real doozy. Beanie Baby trading cards. Um, it's just kind of fucking photos of Beanie Babies put on hard cardboard. Um, It'd be a little bit distressing if you won something like this. 2,000 prize cards worth over $20,000. Um, you can win free products and things. Don't forget to join the unofficial Beanie Baby fan club, which is apparently organized by Les and Sue Fox. Whoever the fuck that might be, not affiliated with TY. Jesus fucking Christ. I, I've, got, I've got tons of these things everywhere. All right, let's open up another one of these. Uh, let's open up... A Link one. I think we've already opened up a Link one. Oh, here we go. Win with Link. Oh, that's sick. See what I mean? Why would you want to take that sticker off? Just leave it on there. Zelda 2 secret tip on the back there. Um, and then we've got another Punch-Out sticker. We've got um, Soda Popinski. Is that where Soda Poppin got his name from? Punch-Out! Between rounds, press the select button rapidly to recover lost energy. All right, Super Mario 2, here's um, some more of these things. Uh, scratch cards, Mario vs. the blooper. 
It's got a... Why does it have so many fucking tentacles? Who drew this? Why are these two on the side all like... They don't... <laughs> okay. Um, we've got another Double Dragon one, and we have another Mario one. Where the fuck is Birdo's... Suck snout. Seriously, why does Birdo have like a, a stump nose there? Birdo's supposed to look like this. Alright, let's see if this is... Playable. I don't... I know you're supposed to use a coin, but I feel like... I feel like these are so old that that's just not gonna work. Guys, this is... That's just... <laughs> that is not possible. Old age has not done these well. I'm just destroying the cards. Like, look at that. I also just want to let you guys know that, um... Uh, these are a bit finicky to value because they're sort of like... They do sell and people do buy individual cards. But they're so old that it's it's sort of just people wanting to buy an individual one to complete their set. Those ones are kind of already a bit scratched. Um, so I, I don't feel happy about really valuing them or whatever, but the actual packs themselves, they also vary in price, but you can get a decent price if you buy a whole box. Here's Link getting blackmailed into taking a foot job from this old woman. Uh, she says, we've got a score to settle. He's not looking comfortable about that. She's also hinting that she might be using those anal beads. Oh, that's nasty. And then last of all, win with Mario. Uh, this and the Zelda card seem to be the most popular ones selling on eBay. I've got a question. Why is this Mario's face all red like he's really embarrassed? And this one is not at all. In fact, none of them are except this one. Is this a rare? Is this rare red alternate... Reskinned Mario? Or has he just got a sunburn? I think the, the packet's just rubbed off on him. Um, Alright, we've got... We'll save those ones for the end. Let's take these scratch cards. Which ones do we have here? Ooh, the fucked up blooper. Double Dragon again. Mario vs. the Snoutless Birdo. Seen them all before, brother. And then some tips for Super Mario Bros. 2. And Punch-Out, which are... A Super Mario Bros. header there? It's... Are these supposed to be eggs? Those aren't collectibles in the game, are these marbles? And secondly... <laughs> where is this in the lore? Where- <laughs> it probably is somewhere, Mario's done so much shit. Is this- is this the original Mario Kart? Mario Steam-mobile? Okay, we're gonna open up a Link one here. See what we can get out of this. We've got uh, Chinte, uh, Double Dragon I'm assuming. Legend of Zelda. That's actually a cool sticker. That's neat. I like that one. Um, and then we've got these scratch cards. Seen it. Seen it. Ooh, Soda Popinski. He's a big bloody unit, this bloke. Why is the Monopoly man showing up to this? Shouldn't he be putting people out of business? Uh, another Link one. Let's see what we can get from this. Okay, here we go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I can't... You want to save those for last. Ooh, there's a different one. Um, Link vs. a three-headed dragon. Ooh, a Link vs. a millipede. <laughs> a biggie-pede. And another punch-out, Mr. Sandman. Alright, let's take a proper- I can't actually get these off. It, it's truly, like, fucked, but if we take a look at the back, we can read the in instructions. How to play. Uh, KO. Need two for knockout. If you scratch off three punching gloves, you lose. If you scratch off a low blow, you automatically uh, disqualified. What the fuck is the difference between automatic disqualification and you lose? Shouldn't these just read the same? If you if you if you scratch off this thing, you get two KOs. And if you, scr <laughs> if you scratch off that, you try again. This makes no sense. Scratch off until the fighter is defeated or you have been knocked out or disqualified. Just make them the same thing. Try to defeat the boxer with the least amount of punches. You win nothing. Give this to your son if he has no friends. Or daughter. Girls can play video games. Alright, Mario. Give it to me straight. What's it gonna be, brother? We've got a... Wait, save those ones. We've got Mario vs. the Bluefish. Cheap, cheap. Uh, another the Double Dragon, haven't seen that one. Ooh, Mario vs. Shy Guy. This one has filled out a bit. It's been hitting the gym, he's not as lumpy. This cannon trajectory makes no sense. Who the fuck did the art for this? Also, it looks like he's thrown that. 
And that's going right down this way. I don't think Mario squatting and taking a shit, doing a, a slav squat, is going to help him out. And then we've got... Okay, baby. Another win with Mario. And another Link getting sucked off by an old witch. The doubles are coming in strong. I want to complete my set. The, uh, the scratch cards are not as appealing. The card, These cards, the card stickers, those are the ones you want, I think. Um, Alright, let's take a look at these. Link versus the dragon. Link versus a brown eagle. And Mario versus the ledges. How do we play this one? Find three misses and you lose. Find three right-facing arrows and you win. That's actually kind of cool. It says find three arrows to advance. Like you set these up. Or maybe they all like lay out as like a whole level thing. And you've got to actually scratch between them all to see how far you can get. That'd actually be kind of cool. Like you go from this level to this level. How much actually, how many are there for the scratch cards? Collect all 60 scratch off game cards. Fucking hell. I ain't doing that. I don't even want them. I want the sticker cards. Let's see what we got here. Super Mario Bros. is the title card. That's nice. And a Bobo. Alrighty. Alright. Another one. A lot of Topps cards have um, gum in them. I'm actually surprised these ones don't have any. Uh, take those off. Let's have a look at these. There's one we haven't seen. There's one we haven't seen. There's one we have seen. Mr. Sandman double. And then up next we've got... Okay, that's neat. That's cool. Uh, it's a shame you had to ruin it with all this fucking shit. Trademarks on every single individual sticker. And then we've got... Link, 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 Link! What is this, the prequel to that Four Swords? Alrighty, yeah! <laughs> Let's have a look what we got. Oh, wait. Oh. Ah! Okay, here we go. Scratch cards. Fucking hell, that is evil. What are those, eyeballs? It's just kind of getting glanced at. You can kind of cheat a bit if this came off at all, which it does not. And another Mario one there. And then the cards on the end. That's a double. And that is a double. I got a feeling these don't have as great of an abundance as um, the scratch cards. Uh, collect all 33 tip cards. Okay, so these are kind of cool. All right. All right, let's speed through the rest of these guys. Uh, we've got... Um... <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, why my main man Bowser orange? Is this the Mushroom Kingdom or Jersey Shore? Uh, Peach is um, got brown hair there. And uh, Mario is missing his cap. Then we've got Link versing this octopus that's throwing rocks at him. That's kind of rude. And then we've got Piston Honda. And the two sticker cards are... And the two sticker cards are a double and a double. Eat shit and try again. Okay, let's see what we got here. Haven't got that before. That's kind of cool. Why is his hat just always off? And why would you wear that out if you had such an important job in saving the kingdom? And we finally got King Hippo. Oh yeah! The one and only. And then um, the tip cards. We've got Lil Mac finally there. Giving a nice little punch. And on the end we've got Super Macho Man. Another punch out card. Glad to get two of those. We've only got two more packs here to open. Let's see what we got on these ones. Double. Double. And Mario's Glory Hole Shy Guy Pipe. And for these... We've got, oh la la, Linda, what that whip do? Oh, you know why she needs those knee pads, right? I'll, oh, I'll let you figure it out. And then we've got uh, this double that we've seen before. And we're opening up our last pack here, guys. I know this has been a bit of a weird episode. I do like to do different stuff every now and then. It's kind of interesting. Uh, there's a bullet bill. There's two Marios for some reason. This could be... An evil one plotting to take the place of this one. Very weird stuff going on with these uh, scratch cards. Uh, Mario there in, in the desert. There's some animal corpse. And our final... Whoa! Mario Madness. What is that? I've not heard of that. Mario Madness. Is that anything? Comment below if that's anything. Or if that's just an abstract thing for this artwork. And on the end, win with Link, which we have seen before. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's wind down with a Forbidden Light booster pack. You know I had to do it to him. I always want to sort of wind down with something like this. Here is the code card. Three to the front. Get rid of this. Bring ourselves more into 
the current times. Goomy, Gibble, e Little Egg, Goomy again, Bergmite, Crash Awake, Reverse, and Vavillion. Fuck you. Thank you so much for watching, guys. My name is Max Mofo. Make sure you smack that fucking bell button, hit subscribe, press like, watch a few other videos to support the channel, and I'll see you guys when I see you.